Nuha says, can we make wudu with oil on our hair? Is the wudu valid? We know that in order for your wudu to be valid is that your organs are washed and there is no layer between the water and your skin. So if I have a big paint spot on my hand and I perform wudu, my wudu is invalid because the paint is a layer that prevents water from going and reaching my skin. Likewise, if a woman has nail varnish or nail uh, uh, polish, this is a hard substance that prevents water from reaching your nails, whether it's breathable or non-breathable. This is all bogus. It prevents water from reaching your, your nails and your wudu is invalid. There is an exception of two things. One, of wiping over the socks because the sunnah permits that. So I did not wash my feet. Rather, I simply wiped over them in wudu. This is valid, providing that I wore the socks after performing ablution. So I am in the state of minor ritual purity. I'm in the state of wudu. I put them on. Now, next time I make wudu, I can wipe over them. And there are a number of other conditions. The other exception is wiping over the hair. Because wiping does not mean washing. It is a more simpler way of doing it. So we have authentic hadiths stating that the Prophet ﷺ, when he went for Umrah and for Hajj, he used to put a substance similar to glue on his hair. And this substance keeps the hair intact and fixed. He's traveling for a couple of weeks time. So he definitely performed wudu, which means that wiping over this substance is okay and legit. Nowadays, we have hair gel to those who use it. I don't have hair to use it, so I don't know how it is uh, uh, implemented, but those who do, who do, you see that their hair is so stiff and fixed, it cannot move. Even if they jump or fall, it's fixed. So such gel prevents water from reaching the hair, but you can wipe on that without any problem. When performing ghusl, this is not sufficient. You have to wash it off to ensure that the, the water reaches every single hair and your scalp as well. So if you have hinna on your hair, you just apply it hinna and it has to stay for an hour or two so that the color sticks and it's time for prayer with the henna on your head, there's no problem in wiping over it. If you have hair gel, there's no problem. If you have oil, it is also permissible and Allah knows best.